marriage is beautiful in that it is a showcase, a display, a shadow of the Lord Jesus Christ's covenant keeping grace. As the creator and author of marriage, God the Father is using marriage to give us a picture of his plan from eternity past to secure a people for himself for all eternity. That's what we are witnessing today. God calls his people the church and says that Jesus is the head of the church and that Jesus is the groom and the church is the bride. Could it be that God created marriage just so we could see this picture? That we could understand more about him? I, Robert, take the end to be my wanted wife, to have and to hold from this day forward. For better or worse, for richer or poor, sickness and health. To forgive you as I have been forgiven. To love and cherish until death do us part. According to God's holy instruction, I pledge myself to you. I, Anna, take thee, Robert, to be my wedded husband, to have and to hold from this day forward. For better, for worse, for richer, for in sickness or in health, to forgive you as I have been forgiven. To love and to cherish till death do us part. According to God's holy instruction, I pledge myself to you. In conformity with your mutual declaration and pledges, and by the authority vested in me, and in the name of the Holy Spirit of God himself, I now pronounce you husband and wife. Robert, you may kiss your bride.